Hello everyone, welcome to Wrath of Math. I'm your host Sean Ian. In today's video we are talking about the product rule for exponents. In particular, we're asking why does it work? So let's look at an example. The product rule tells us that 3, for example, 3 to the power of 4 multiplied by 3 to the power of 2 is equal to 3 to the power of 6. We've got two numbers, we've got the same base, and they're raised to some power. Because we have the same base and they're being multiplied, all we have to do is add the exponents. But why is that? Well, to see it, all you really have to do is write it out. So we have 3 to the 4th, which is 3 times 3 times 3 times 3, and that's multiplied by 3 squared, which is 3 times 3. And you can see very clearly here, this is effectively the definition of 3 to the 6. We've got 6 3's, so we get 3 to the 6. Now what about the product rule with negative exponents? Say we have 3 to the 3rd, and we multiply that by 3 to the negative 2nd. The product rule tells us that this is equal to simply 3. Well, if we write it out, we get 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3, and this gets multiplied by 1 3rd multiplied by 1 3rd because the negative exponent rule tells us that 3 to the negative second is the same as 1 over 3 squared, which is 1 over 3 multiplied by 1 over 3. Now this is equal to 3 times 3 times 3 divided by 3 times 3. You see we get two pairs of 3's that cancel out, and we are left with 3, which is the same as 3 to the first. So I hope this video helped explain why the product rule for exponents works. Let me know in the comments if you want any other videos or if you need anything about this video clarified. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time and be sure to subscribe for the swankiest math videos on the internet. I can hear your voice from all the way up here, dear. Won't you please come to me? You love it up here, dear. There's a light where I float that erases.